Greetings YouTube and beyond, my name sounds like Air Race 7 and today I present to you the bane of every engineer's existence, the NG Bully. The name in and of itself describes the role well enough. The NG Bully's sole purpose is to make every engineer's life a living hell. Every other idiot on the field is completely ignored. Every time something is built, the engineer bully is nearby, hiding behind a rock or pile of crates, eyeing every sentry, dispenser, or teleporter, grinning like Michael Jackson at the Kids' Choice Awards. Your loadout is made up of a lot of less than generic spy elements. The most important one is the red tape recorder. Nothing pisses off an engineer more than his building being downgraded. It's torture on the same level as a car battery to the nipples, waterboarding, or throwing a diabetic into a vat of chocolate syrup. He's running to the aid of his sentry in full panic while second by second his precious little toy is being unborn. Your primary must be the ambassador. All it takes is one nonchalant shot to the cranium and he goes from calm and quiet to what the f*** was that? A couple more shots and he's taking his well-deserved dirt nap. Also, your knife can be anything except for the Your Eternal Reward or the Wanga Prick. Personally, I use my stock knife, the Swagger Dagger. But in the end, it's all based upon personal preference. Now, lastly, you'll be needing the Cloak and Dagger. Your job as the NG Bully is to pester, annoy, antagonize, irritate, and infuriate the other team's engineers. One of the best ways to do that is to disguise as an enemy engineer and cloak yourself. Sneak up to and crouch nearby an NG nest. Once you're in place, start spamming SPY! And just sit back and watch as the Hordus nest starts to buzz. Keep spamming and see how long it takes them to find you. It's a circus in and of itself. Now to really piss off an engineer, you'll have to destroy his hard work. But you can't do it quickly, that's what the red tape record is for. Within seconds, all the time and effort put into finding metal and upgrading those precious little robots of his will be slowly washed away. If he can get there in time and breaks your portable torture device, throw caution on the winds and start spamming sappers like Al Roker spams, here's what's happening in your neck of the woods. He'll eventually get fed up with continuously removing the endless stream of sappers and go after you, which is your chance to piss on his parade. If he starts chasing you, backpedal away from him and drill him with a few bad acid bullets. If you're lucky, you'll give him a third eye right between the two he has and he'll hit the floor like Drowning Pool predicted. Which is your chance to prance on back to his cute little toys and give yourself a good time. When playing as the NG Bully, you have to focus solely on the engineers and ignore everyone else more than OJ's jury ignore the evidence. Taunt after every NG you backstab, whisper SPY into his ears like a predatory ghost, and use the red tape recorder to peel his band-aids off slowly. This has been Air Race 7, How to NG Bully. Now go piss off some hard hats.